Hi, I'm Tony Stefano, Hillside Christmas Tree Farm. Today I wanted to give a little update on kind of that problem area of the Canaan fir that we were having. And I wanted to walk through before I did some pruning. Um, I'm doing some top work today, so I thought I'd, I'd give a little update. Let's look how the trees are looking, uh, how much they've grown, kind of their color, and some of the weed problems we're still continuing to have with this field. So I thought I'd give a little walk through uh, today. So follow along. As we walk down, you see we have some pretty good growth on these trees. Still some trees that are definitely probably not gonna make anything Christmas-wise, but for the most part, good growth on top. Some of the colors looking better. Um, obviously in the fall, we'll really be able to tell what that looks like because everything is green this time of year. It's actually mid-July, so we'll see what it looks like in a couple months as the stuff hardens off. Um, again, on the ground you see a lot of broadleaf a lot of thistle one of the biggest problem weeds we've had in this area is thistle and we did a spring application of uh, simazine and glyphosate <laughs> so we should uh we had some good early early uh i don't know control and then throughout the year it's been getting worse and we've been mowing so We'll take a little, just a little gander. Kind of like I said in the past, this field has been planted over probably three or four years. I think three. So we see trees of different sizes. And it gets bigger as we kind of head up toward the house. So that's it uh we'll definitely keep an eye on i'm going to pull a soil test later in the fall and we'll see if we've made any changes and compare it year over year and we'll go from there i think that does it so uh thanks for watching thanks again for watching this video i hope you saw something that will help you succeed on your farm if you didn't check out some of these other videos that i've created for you hit that subscribe button if you haven't already so you don't miss out on any future content Lastly, if you'd like to support the channel, please consider use, using the Buy Me a Coffee or affiliate links in the description below.